Hello Arts Friends! This is Joycey, the creator behind Artsy Joycey. Welcome or welcome back to my channel! In today's video, let me share how to customize a fleece blanket. Now let's hop on to Cricut Design Space and on the hamburger menu, select the machine that you will be using and I will be using my Cricut Maker for this project. This project is dedicated to my friend's son and now let me type in his name. To change the default font, go to the edit tab and select your preferred font under the font name. I am using Hello Honey on this project and it is available in the font.com and I will place its link under the description box below. Now, I wanted the space in between his name to be smaller and to do that, I will decrease it through the line space tab. I will just click the negative sign up until I reach the desired spacing to my liking. And this time, I will resize my design accordingly. I am happy with my design, so Let's make it! We will be cutting an iron-on material, so always remember to turn the mirror button on. Now, we will be selecting the glittered iron-on for our material. To prepare my iron-on vinyl, always place it shiny side down the mat. To prepare my fleece blanket, I wash it without fabric conditioner and to remove chemicals that may prohibit strong adhesion. I refer to Cricut Heat Guide and I will just input my material which is Smart Glitter Iron On and Polyester as my base material. In just one click, now I know the preferred temperature and time setting for these materials. To prepare my Easy Press 2, I will adjust my temperature to 165 degrees Celsius and time to 30 seconds. Now, I am preheating my material for at least 5 seconds to remove moisture and lint rolling it to remove visible lints and dirt. Now, I will place my iron on face down and liner up. And then, I will place a protective sheet over it and press it with light pressure at 165 degrees Celsius for 30 seconds. Since my design is slightly larger than my easy press, I will press it twice for good measure. Now, I will flip my material over and press 15 seconds each side. And then, I will slowly remove the liner when it's cooler to touch. Presenting our finished project! If you like more Cricut Crafts and tutorials, please like and subscribe and See you on the next one. Bye!